artists, Mary Ann here. Um, we are going to draw a partying llama today. Yes, that's right. A llama who is going to a party. I don't know what kind of party this llama is going to. It could be a birthday party, or maybe it's a graduation party, or maybe it's just a back to school party. But whatever it is, the llama is pretty excited to go. Um, we're going to draw something that looks like this. Um, let me show you some other examples here. Uh, like this right here. Um, as you can see, it's very colorful. Um, you can put whatever you want on the llama's back. Um, the two examples here, as you can see, have a bowl of fruit, a basket of fruit, and some flowers. But um, what I love about this project is all the fun things you can decorate your llama with with all the little necklaces and bells and lights and blankets um, and hats. I love hats. I love this one here it has flowers on her head. Um, just very fun. So you have a lot of flexibility of how you want to decorate your llama. And um, I think we should get going here. Let's start. Let's talk materials. You'll need a pencil, some good drawing paper, and something to color with. Okay, we are going to focus our drawing on the left side of the paper. This is where the llama's head is going to go, and this is where the body will be. So we want to move on over to the left-hand side, and I'm very lightly sketching what it's going to look like, the shape. I don't know if you can see that, but let's start off with the head. Uh, we're going to start off with the eyes by making two um, kind of squished U shapes. And then we're going to put some eyelashes on our llama, just like this. Next, we're going to make a little V nose and then the mouth, just like this. There we go. He's happy and looks like he's at peace. He's going to a party. Okay, next we're going to define the mouth and the nose by emphasizing like the muzzle area. Oops, there we go. And we're going to start drawing the side of its head. Now, he has really fuzzy, fluffy fur. Uh, they use it for a lot of um, products that people wear. So it's soft and fluffy. And now we're going to start on his back or her back. And his or her tummy. Now we're going to make uh, the top of his leg. And again, we're going to emphasize how fluffy these llamas are. So those, here we got our, our two front legs. Just like that. And now we'll do the two rear legs. Same as the front, except in the back. Voila. Okay, now here are uh, several different ideas of how you can decorate your llama. You've got fruit and flowers and hats. So I am going to start off with the llama's blanket. And I'm going to just wing it and see what happens. Play with different shapes. And here we go.
and there you have it. Now you can decorate your background any way you like. Where is your llama? What does your party look like? That is up to you. All right, everyone. Well, I hope you had fun drawing your llama. Um, if you could, I would love to see the results. Um, there should be a section here on this web page where you could submit your drawings. I would love to see them. That would be fantastic. Um, I hope you can join me again for another drawing tutorial. But until then, happy arting.